This is the Orter Laser Master 3 Light Edition laser engraver. So you can see here, I'm just kind of practicing on some wood pieces, made this cool design. It cut really nice in just one pass. I do have some burn marks just because I didn't have a good surface to put it on, but you can send that right out. But this is at about 700 millimeters per second at full power and it just cuts right through the wood. It is pretty thin wood, so no huge surprise there, but it has really nice precision, really nice detail. So it comes in this box, not too big. It does have a manual for how to put things together, or there's a really good video that Orter put online to help you kind of get things set up and put together. So this is me kind of assembling it. It took me about 30 minutes to put it together and then, you know, some more time just to get it up and running. But I just started with some cardboard to practice some things out and get it to see if I could get it to work with my software and just get familiar with it. And I've been really happy with it. It has really good precision, nice, steady movements. It doesn't shake or wobble or anything like that. You get good straight lines, really nice, easy cuts and engravings. So here I'm doing a graham cracker. I don't know why I decided to do it on a graham cracker, but my boys ended up really liking that. So I did a lot of these on graham crackers. I did this on March 10th. So, you know, you got to do Mario, but my boys have a lot of fun watching this and participating with me. I can only do one boy at a time because I've got limited safety glasses, but it is a lot of fun. It's a really nice laser engraver. So here you can see the wood piece that I cut. You can see some of the wood here is just super small, really nice and fine details. Another thing I tried was doing this Mario. Now it looks like this might be engraved, but it's not, it's actually cut. So you can see these are lines. Let me shine a flashlight through the back of this. I'm, I'm showing you this so you can get an idea of how fine a laser cut this is and just the detail on this really quite impressive. This is the first laser graver I've had. It's been a lot of fun learning about laser engraving and setting things up and there's still a lot that I need to learn. I've been using Laser Gerbil for my software to get things set up. Overall, the setup for the hardware was nice and easy. Using it did take a little bit of practice and I'm still trying to get familiar with what settings I need to use for what materials, but overall it's got good fine quality detail it's a really nice laser engraver. This was sent to me so I could do this video review and I have not used another laser engraver before so I don't have anything to really compare it with. I will say though, I haven't had any real problems with it. The instructions were nice and simple and easy enough for me to follow. I didn't need to use the video online. I was able to use the manual it came with to get everything set up. I think for me, honestly, the biggest hurdle was just learning how to use the software. Now there's a couple different software options you can use. I decided to use is the free one, which I think is a little bit harder to learn, but it does work and it has been a lot of fun. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.